Carro. I have some beautiful butterflies coming up for you, being it's Transformation Week on the Guiding Halo channel. All the information to buy some will be under the description box below. Blessings. Hey everybody, so this is Transformation Week on the Guiding Halo channel, and this is what it's going to be all about, okay? Blue Butterfly. It's no accident that the butterfly represents transformation, rebirth, and resurrection. Remarkably, when the caterpillar becomes a chrysalis, it doesn't just instantly become a butterfly. It actually dissolves into a kind of soup. In other words, it liquefies itself, and out of that emerges something completely different. It is a true transformation. In some cultures, sorry about that, blue butterflies are considered very good luck, and even wish, wishes, wish granters. In Native American tribes, it is believed that a wish whispered to a butterfly will be granted when it flies to the heavens. The Native American shawl dance, which celebrates renewal, is derived from the butterfly dance. Also, the color blue represents a calmness, peace, and a spiritual attunement. And the blue butterfly is thought to carry all these meanings. This is a time for change, reinvention, or rebirth into a new way of being. If you've been plodding along, this card suggests that you take measures to shift everything. Don't resist change. The blue color suggests a spiritual renewal or initiation. Transformation doesn't mean taking something old and remodeling it or rearranging a few things. It means becoming something completely different or doing something completely different. Change is often uncomfortable, but it is usually for the highest good. This is a very lucky card, and drawing this card can mean that a wish may be about to come true. How beautiful is that? So a transformation week, you're going to see the previous video that's up before you see this part of the video. And it's there's butterflies that a lady builds, and it's out of resin, and they're absolutely stunning. And I'm sure she could build whichever butterfly you like, like to make it. And so I'm going to put her links, they'll be down below, and her Facebook page. So you can connect with her about these beautiful butterflies. And when you get them, I would strongly suggest that you, or before you buy them, that you buy it with the intention to bring good luck and beautiful new wishes coming true into your life. And when you buy something with that intention, my friends, everything, as we all know, is all about the intention we set for it. I love you guys. So let's get started with your readings. Okay, my Leo friends, let's pull a activation card, the Power of Love activation cards from James Von Brocht. Here is the book that goes along with it. So let's pull one and see how the divine is trying to activate your heart. How is trying to activate you? What part of you needs to be activated? Oh my goodness, my Leos, you're being elevated. You are making conscious decisions to raise your vibration of love. That is beautiful. Man, is that going to transform your world? Holy crap. When someone gets into that energy of love and you get elevation and the divine is transforming, in, or you're going to have a wish granted. Yeah, you are transforming you into absolute love energy this is amazing anticipation something wonderful is happening changes in the air open yourself to blessings on their way expect them because that's what's coming this card is about wishes granted it's been a hard time transformation is coming it's going to be beautiful elevation you are making the conscious decision to raise your vibration of love, to be a more loving person, to watch the words that come out of your mouth so that they can be in love, to, to bring love to all that you do. And when you do that, my God, the way your life transforms is just impeccable. 
Yeah, look at justice coming in. With this new elevation and how it is that the divine is opening your heart, it brings justice to situations that, that have been so unfair and so unjust. You could be dealing with a Libra in some sort of sense here. I believe that came out in the Libra reading as well. Um, a passionate offer, a money or a job or something, uh, something that's coming to you because of the love you offer and someone sees you as the way you are. It's an opportunity, a huge opportunity, I might add. And it's just it come to you now for whatever that is. I'm getting that this could be a home based self-employment business. Well, there you go. That, that proves that. So somebody, it could make you a lot of money. A lot of money. Bam. Going into hermit mode, asking the divine for clarity about what comes next. Perhaps you've been in confusion about it uh, on a different front in your life. Perhaps too many cards. There was victory and a challenging truth that came. So someone might need have a victory and then need, feel the need to defend their victory. I'm not sure. Let's pull it. I want to pull a clarification on this left side here on this elevation. Yeah, all up in your head, stress, worry. You're, you're thinking about this new thing at night and whether it's doable based on your circumstances. So it, it's not really stress, worry, and aggravation. It's like sleepless nights and it's like I just want to sleep but unfortunately a lot of times when you're being elevated emotionally the only time that you can really ponder things quietly because there's so much going on during the day and it's not just your emotions and feelings it's all those around you and if you're an empath you feel everybody within a you know five mile radius at times it feels like so it's the only time at night that you can actually gain clarity by thinking about where how it is you want to move forward yeah you're in your mind about a bloody battle winning at all costs there's something that someone has wanted to win at all costs perhaps it's to bring in the new perhaps there's a battle you would really like to walk away from and perhaps it's this this thought process at night could be it could be stress that's getting you and worry and aggravation about money but justice is coming in here financially for you and a brand new start ensues. Look at that. You have everything in your arsenal. You have to anticipate the beauty that's coming in, just like this card says. It might just be. It might just be the music. Wow, your heart's been waiting to hear. Look at that. Brand new start. Leveling you straight up into Empress mode, my friends. How beautiful. Wow. My Leo friends, look at you. Wow. Too many, thank you too many stay in my hand thank you transformation I feel like you're all over the place it's like one minute you're this and one minute you're that one minute you're in your heart space the next minute you're in your head there's been a temporary pause in action a wait a seven month seven years something maybe you've been dealing with for seven years that's going to come to fruition for you look at that Wow, and it's because you're taking control. The emperor, this could be father and mother figure for someone, or hmm, pull another card. Could be boss, employer, judge. An ingenious idea that comes to you on a whim or on a, someone is coming in here. Could be an older man that's going to have an ingenious idea or has challenging information it could be about his health yeah uh wow the cards are just falling out major arcana massive change for my leos taking control over what you have felt tied to and letting it go and stepping into unconditional love there's something about a capricorn here uh aries scorpio aquarius Libra, Virgo, and Taurus, Libra energy, Cancer, everybody's here, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, look at that, and it all has to do, all of this is going on behind the scenes, and it all has to do with you taking control of how you move yourself forward with your emotions and with love. You are making the conscious decision 
to raise your vibration of love and to be a more loving person to yourself, to others, and how you move forward. And justice is coming in here because it's time. Look at these three cards that trump the reading. Look at this. Justice is coming to an emperor and an empress. I'm telling you, you guys are elevating financially. You guys are elevating in in home status, in children status, in everything status. Uh, it very well could be if you're married that that you or your your spouse gets a brand new raise or a job. It could be that their job is going to bring challenging information and and maybe the emperor challenging information. Yeah. Clarity something that you have to work through but you don't go it it's not that you have to go it alone see here we have this guy on this trusty steed alone moving his heart forward it's not like you have to go at things alone there are people to help you and I, maybe that's why you're trying to take a higher elevation towards love here being elevated because in order to have those people help you you have to have a, a new or a higher vibration where love is concerned yeah, look at that divine movement forward. That's beautiful. Ah, my Leo friends. Look at that. That's beautiful. I'm just saying, the divine's moving you forward and elevating you to the brand new justice is coming in. We have an emperor and an empress here where justice is coming to. And I'm telling you, your lives are going to be transformed. That's beautiful. Beautiful energy, my Leo friends. I love you guys. Oh, I almost forgot to pull angel message. Just pull angel message cards for my Leos, please. I <laughs> told you. Money. I'm the angel of abundance. You will receive the money that you need, and God is in charge of how that will happen. Have faith. It is safe for you to be powerful in a loving way that benefits yourself as well as others. See? Elevating. Elevation. You are making a conscious decision to raise your vibration of love. It does not mean not being powerful. It means knowing in the knowledge aspect of you how to combine the knowledge and the emotion to make it all work. What a beautiful reading, my Leo friends. Wow. I love you guys. I hope it resonates. Talk to you again soon.